Hello, my friends. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're doing good. I hope you're ready for another YouTube video from your old buddy, Dadcraft73. We're back here playing some Age of Engineering, some 1.10 mod of Minecraft. And man, you know we're having a good old time. Oh, man, are we ever. So I just logged in after having this spawner chunk loaded. And I just I did, just came down here and turned it off. Made sure it was set to in because I don't want any more power coming out of this thing. But let's take a look at our small storage crate and see how we did overnight. Yeah, working like a dream, I would assume. <laughs> oh yeah. That's amazing. We have tons of experience, which is kind of cool. But more importantly, we have tons of blaze rods, and we never have to worry about it again. We'll just leave the rest of those in there. We'll go put these over here in our storage system. And then I think we need to get in here and see if we can't bust through the age 9 barrier and get that squared away. That will be awesome. Let's go over here, and I will dump all of you in here like so. And I will go here and like that. Okay. So... Age nine. That's what we're looking to do. Oh, we did make this thing. I, I don't. I don't. <laughs> <dang it. laughs> oh man, what am I? I don't even know where. I, you know, I we got so lost playing applied energistics uh, craziness that we sort of, I guess, just bypass the foot maybe it just didn't click in my brain you would think i knew what i was doing but it's obvious that i don't all right well that means we need to get into the technical age and we need to see if we can't make one of these a machine block so i want to get age nine and ten done and then we're gonna to have to probably pause a little bit and figure out what we need to make Blast furnace, uh, vacuum freezer. That's the reason we did all this bee stuff. We got to see what we need to do, and then we'll look at getting into the space age. We got to make some stuff, and then there comes the mechanical age, draconic age, and finally creative. Oh man, uh, it kind of makes me a little. I think we have tons of content here in these last couple ages, so I'm not too worried about it. But man, we're getting down, getting down there. So. To, to get to the technological age, let's go here and then type in age 10. Okay, there we go. We need a machine block. And a machine block is made from refined iron ingots. And to make the refined iron ingots, you need an electric solidifier. Okay. Okay. So we have this thing. And I guess we can put it down. I don't even know if we even put it down on the ground since we got it. All right. So... RF goes in here, something goes in here, and something goes out there. Okay. Okay. I'm not sure exactly what. Is there like a recipe thing? I better get my wrench out. I'm not sure exactly how to break these guys. I would assume this is how you do it, but I guess we'll figure out together. Well, that doesn't work. Is there a wrench from Neotech before we get too crazy? There is. All right, let's make one of those just in case that's what we need to have to break these. I don't know if they're like IC2 machines, but I'd rather test it to verify before we go crazy. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that's what we want to do. Okay. So let's take a look at our guide one more time and see what we need to do to get here. The Neotech solidifier is capable of turning steel into Tech Reborn's refined iron. This means you can now craft a machine frame and start with Tech Reborn. Tech Reborn requires EU. RF support is disabled for this pack. Okay. 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 So we have this. And let's take a look at Neotech. There's a bunch of broken textures there. It's kind of weird. Okay, so we have the electric electric crucible. We need the electric solidifier. And that's not too bad. We could probably make that like right now if we wanted to. We certainly have these and diamonds. Tommy calculator. We need to make some fire diamonds. How do we make those? Okay, that's why we got all those blaze rods. Okay, okay. Okay, diamonds. And we have tons of flawless diamonds. Those are the ones, right? Fire diamond. 
Yeah, flawless. Okay. Well, let's get a stack of these. All right. And let's get some blaze rods. And we'll get one, two stacks of those. We'll take these over here to our atomic calculator that we have sitting right here. And we will go like this. And we'll make a stack of these guys. And then we'll go out here and we'll put these in our conductor mass. And we'll just grind out a stack of these fire diamonds. I mean, it's not a problem. We have tons of RF just sitting in here, chilling, doing its thing. And we can just click all these guys in there. It's going to take a few seconds for them to crank out, but not too bad. So that, that can just do its thing for a minute. And then we have to go back and read H9. Crucible, Centrifuge, and Solidifier. Okay, so let's take a look here at um, Centrifuge from Neotech. Not that one, this one. Okay, we need a steel ingot, some silver ingots, some mica, stabilized into pearl. Yeah, it's super easy. Okay, okay. We're going to make these machines, and we'll hook them up and see how they work. Now, I wanted to look and see if this thing had, like, recipes. So we want to look at refined iron. Okay. So electric solidifier, molten steel comes from the crucible right here. All right, so we put steel in, we get that out. Okay, or the electric alloy, which is iron and carbon. I wonder how fast these things are. I don't think they're very fast. I know that they have like all these upgrade slots, so we may have to take a look and see how fast these things are. Let's grab these for now. We'll let the rest of those run, and at least we have some of these guys. we got to make some end diamonds, which shouldn't be that big of a deal. We just need some obsidian and some end stone, which we have stacks on stacks of, so we're not too worried about it. Let's see. End diamonds. We have two with us already, so we need end stone and obsidian, so end stone we might as well get a stack of that and obsidian we might as well get a stack of that okay we'll take these over here to our atomic calculator and we'll click these guys in like so and we'll have a bunch of end diamonds okay we'll just leave those other guys in there we're going to get the rest of those diamonds out of that thing okay let's make some machines shall we so we need an electric crucible we don't have these things right okay we don't okay so we need electric crucible electric crucible we need one of these that's what we already have okay we need the solidifier this guy okay let's make one of these might as well make two of those we're gonna need them okay and do I have the rest of this stuff yeah okay done okay and then the centrifuge was the other one right uh, this guy okay done all right well there's those three three machines okay wonder what tier they are let's just take a look here and see i was uh, maybe it doesn't say they do take eu i think is what maybe not maybe they take redstone flux oh don't do that okay come with me guy okay so we need to get these on some sort of power network i just oh, man literally i just tore down this stuff right here it's even still in my inventory let's run this wire back across here. Oh, do I have some cobble? I do. Okay, let's put some cobble there. And let's just run these guys. Okay. Now, let's put down... Let's put down this. Okay. Okay. I'm not sure exactly... Oh, we put stuff in there. Okay, so if I put... Let me grab some steel ingots. And we'll throw some steel in there and see if we can't get some molten steel coming out of these things. Steel. Uh, half a stack, maybe? Okay. Let's see what this ends up doing for us. Okay. Oh, daddy, that's slow. Okay, what about um, upgrades for Neotech? Upgrade for Neotech. How about we go here and look at this Neotech. Power supply. 
RF battery. Oh, okay. Hover upgrade, sharpness upgrade, jetpack, silk touch, mining speed, beheading, fortune, protection, lighting. Oh, it's these, maybe. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, do we have any steel in here? Yeah, we do. Okay. Well, I mean, it seems to be working. Uh, we might as well put these other guys down as well. So, we're going to make refined iron is what we want to make. So, let's see. We need... So, electric solidifier. Okay. So, this thing needs to go down. Electric solidifier. Okay. Ingot mode. Okay. And then I guess the question is, what is this for? Is it, it doesn't tell us. We might as well set it down. Alright, and that allows us to do stuff. takes does that go like the other direction maybe okay let's make some processor upgrades for this thing and see if it makes any difference I man I'm sorry my my voice is kind of uh, a little messed up today uh, it's raining nasty weather outside and man I woke up today with some craziness that's for sure uh, let's go here upgrade okay so can we make no, their processor upgrades. It's this stuff right here. Okay, so we can make... Oh, I don't have any string? Dang it. <laughs> okay, well, let's not make those. Um, let's do, though, get a... Do I have a fluid conduit in here? I do. Okay, let's grab these. And I wonder if it's as simple as just pulling items out of here like so, like that. All right, you can be insert... You can be extract, always active. Okay. So molten steel was coming in here. We're running it through the electric solidifier. Okay, yeah. I mean, it seems to be working. Okay. Steel. No. Okay. All right. What does it say? While well, that's running. So that allows me to. That's triple my. My deal. Okay. All right. The Neotech, Neotech Solidifier is capable of turning steel into Tech Reborn's refined iron. This means you can craft a machine frame and start with Tech Reborn. The first goal should be the industrial grinder so that you can get additional items from grinding ores. You need a multi-block behind it, a 3x3x3 three by three by three in size, 18 center machine casings, 3x3 three three on... Okay. Two reinforced machine casings. Or eight ma reinforced machine casings, three by three hollow in the middle, and a water source in the middle. Then you should work towards the industrial blast furnace, which needs all this stuff. Okay. Now you can make titanium from bauxite and chrome from rubies and advance to the next stage. You also need the electrolyzer. Later on, you also need to make iridium ingots. Iridium you get from sheldonite or platinum. For iridium plates, you need. An implosion compressor. It needs a 3x3 multi-block with standard machine casings in the eight corners and reinforced machine casings in a plus shape on each side. The center is hollow under it. Okay. 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 So let's see what we have here. So we're getting refined iron ingots. I don't know what the conversion rate is, but man, these things are, are crazy slow. We need to go find some string is what we need. I can't believe I don't have any string. I mean, we could do it. We could do it this way. Here, let's, do we have some bones? Okay, we have some bone meal. Do I have a flax seed? <laughs> I do. Okay. Let's sleep through the night real quick. 
I'm going to show you how to make a super overpowered uh, easy mode strength farm. We don't need too much, I don't think. Okay, we'll just go out here. We'll get our fancy end forged hoe. What do I hear? Nothing. Okay. Put that down. Plant that. And then we'll go like this. Okay. Sounds like it's going to be time to fire up a cloche because we're going to need some wool as well. Okay, let's put these in here. And then these processor upgrade deals, right? So let's make a couple of those. Do they not stack? I'll make six of them. Is this what goes in here? Let me see. What do we use these for? This is dual core processor. Can we just convert these guys maybe? Quad core. Okay. Let's um, let's just go all the way, I guess. I don't really know what these things do. I think we're going to need eight of these. One, two, okay. And then processor. We're sort of coming into this a little bit blind because we can make four of those. Okay, one, two, three, four. Okay, and then quad-core processor. Right, one, two of those. Okay, and then an octa core. One of those. Okay, I don't know what this does, but we're going to go find out here immediately. What happens if I click it on there? Okay. Oh, 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 oh. okay. That um, sped that up a substantial amount. Uses a lot of power. We're going to have to look at figuring something, some of that stuff out. Okay, so these things take upgrades as well. Molten steel, turn into ref okay. So let's make some more of those things. We might have to go get some more string, but they're not too expensive. Those upgrades, so we might as well make some of those. Um, how much string do I have now? Uh, a little bit. Okay, let's grab some bones, and we'll take these over here, and we'll throw them in the sag mill real quick, and just grind them out so we get some more bone meal for these guys. Okay, perfect. All right, that's good for now. Let's let the rest of those run, and we'll come back and get them. So if I go over here to my super OP string farm... <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Maybe I don't want to go all the way to quad core. That seems like that burns through tons of power pretty quickly. I don't know. We'll have to see. Okay, there we go. We got a stack and a half of string. That will should last us for a while. Okay, let's take these. Let's do processor upgrades. Oh, I hate when I do that. Processor. Okay, so we need to make some of these. Uh, let's make... How about we get rid of some stuff in our inventory? That might help a little bit. Six, seven, eight... 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, so there should be 16 of those. We need to set up a crafting recipe for those. I mean, we probably could if we want to, but we're just messing around here a little bit. So let's go here, and then I should be able to make 8 of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay. Let's see what these guys do. Oh, why did I hit F? Okay, don't do that. Okay, let's see what happens when... Oh, no, no, what... Hold on. Okay, dual core processor. Let's take one of these out. All right, let's go take one of these out and stick it in there. We might not need to do like all crazy. Okay, so if I go here, that should upgrade this a little bit more. It sounds like there's still like a cooldown. Okay, those aren't great. Get out of there. Okay, <laughs> we want the good stuff. If we're going to do it, we might as well get the good stuff. I have a feeling we're going to be running down the path of getting us some more RF power. Okay, processor, processor. Okay, and we want to make dual cores. These are duals, right? So we want to make quad cores, and we could go like this. What am I missing? Yellow dye. Do I have some dandelions? Yeah, okay. 
Let's take these over and throw them in the sag mill. We'll take our bone meal out and we'll go like that. And then we'll get a bunch. Oh, we're getting the plant clippings. Not that I really care about that. That's plenty for now. All right, let's go put these, put that in there like that. And we're going to make the rest of these, four of these. Okay. Processor. And then we're going to make some of these octocores. We might as well, right? If we're going to do it, we might as well get jacked up all the way and see what... Man, this seems to be okay. It's not too bad. All right, let's put this in here, and I would assume that... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah it's a lot faster. Okay. And it looks like it's a one-for-one. One. We put a half a stack of steel in there, and we just got half a stack of refined iron ingots. Okay. Okay. So I guess the question is, what does this thing do? I don't know. There's not like a recipe tab. I'm not sure exactly what I need to make this. But that being said, we could come right over here and we can go like this, right? There. And we now are in age 10, the technological age. So it sounds like in age 10, we've got a whole bunch of stuff that we have to make. Let's go down and add this to our stack of trophies. Boop. Okay. All right, so there's age 10. Now, let's take a look at our guide and see what it says. The first goal should be the industrial grinder so that you get additional items from grinding ores. Okay. You need a multi-block behind it. Behind it. Okay. 3x3 three three in size, 18 standard machine casings, 3x3 three three on the top and bottom, and 8 reinforced machine casings, 3x3 three three hollow in the middle. Okay, and a water source in the middle. Then you should work towards the industrial blast furnace, which needs a 3x3x4 three by, three by multi-block. Oh my goodness, we're going to have to have some room to make these. Huh, where should we make these crazy guys? I don't even know. I sort of want to go ahead and see if we can, at least in this episode, get the first one made. And we can start playing around with some Tech Reborn stuff. So let's see. Okay, so machine casings is what I need. And I guess they're the Tecra Born machine casings. Here, industrial, industrial grinder. Okay. Oh, daddy. Okay. Tungsten. We need some d grinding heads. Oh, my goodness. What are we? <laughs> what are we about to get ourselves in the middle of? Oh, okay. Okay. Well, we need some circuits. Need some of these okay oh i don't have copper how am i doing copper wise okay i think we can probably i don't know hopefully we can make this thing this might be a little bit of a grind so let's see if we can get it done i think over here i have rubber yeah lots of rubber okay and then in here maybe i got lots of copper of course my inventory is now jacked completely full here let's do this okay And we'll go over here and we'll dump all this stuff in there. Put that in there. That, 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 that. That can go in there. That and that. And our refined iron. Okay. I don't really know how much of that refined iron stuff we're actually going to need. Okay, let's go back down here. And then let's grab the rest of these. These guys. Might as well just get all of that stuff. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's go back upstairs. Okay. All right, so uh, grinder is what we are making. Industrial grinder from Tech Reborn. Okay, so we need three of these to start with. So we need, we need to make some of this stuff right here. Please be quiet, phone. Oh my lord, why are you going crazy? All right, so we need this, this, and this. And we need one, two, three, okay? And then can we make these guys? One, two, three. Okay, good. All right, so that's done. We need an industrial electrolyzer, which requires two more advanced circuits. One. Okay, now we need these. We should just make like a... 
Okay, there we go. All right, so we need one of these. So two of these. Oh my goodness, look at all the crazy stuff we have to make. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh man, we are deep in another rabbit hole. Hey, welcome to the rabbit hole. I'm your host, Dadcraft73. So much extractors, basic machine casing. We need another circuit. So we're going to need three more circuits. One, two, three. Okay. And we have to make three extractors. This guy, can we make these? Oh, we need to get some iron. Okay, let's do this. Iron plate. Iron blocks is what we need. So, do I have... Um, yeah, okay. Block of iron. Bang. There. Um, there, okay. Alright, let's go put these in the block cutter. Oh my goodness, I can't believe we are, we have just, so I knew, I knew things were too easy. <laughs> now, I've never even uh, looked at Tech Reborn before, so we, you guys might need to be giving me some help here. We do have some iron plates here, which is kind of good. All right, we might as well take all this crazy stuff out of here, and take it with us, okay? I was going to say that I had that all planned, but I didn't. Okay, you guys can all go in here, you, you, you you and you okay okay all right so grinder is what we're working on we need to make these so one two three okay and then we have those we need to make some taps we need four of those one two three one two three four okay and then we should be able to make these one Oh, I need lots of more taps, don't I? Okay, so we're going to need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, you guys can all go in there. Now, okay, so let's make at least the first machine here. One, two. Okay, so there's three of those. And then we should be able to make this. Yes? Refined iron ingot, industrial grinder, done. Or ele ele electrolyzer, done. Okay, now we need another macerator. So we need one of these. Can we make that? Yeah, we can make that. And then a macerator, not too hard. Right, done. All right. And then we need advanced machine casing. All right, this is that. Okay, we already have one of those. So we're going to need one of these. Can we just make this? What are we missing? Um, advanced alloy. Compressor. Advanced alloy. Mixed metal. That's all this stuff. Okay. Oh no. And then we can put this in the compressor, I guess. That's okay. We'll go down here and get the stuff we need. Oh my goodness. Compressor. We throw that in there. Uh oh. Compressor. Oh man, we're going to need so much of this stuff. It looks like we're going to need tons of steel. Maybe. Okay. And what's the deal on here? He's this guy's low power. This guy's low power too. Man, where are we gonna put this thing? We're we don't really have the the setup for this kind of stuff. I really want to get it running though. Oh dang it. Okay. So let's go up here, and I guess we'll make this compressor. I mean, I, I don't, I don't know. I guess we're gonna figure it out together. Okay, grinder, no, uh, compressor, and we need this. Okay, no, no, not the implosion, just a compressor from Tech 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 Reborn. Compressor. No, not that. Yeah, so it's not the same one. Why doesn't it show up in... Huh, I don't know. Alright, we're going to do what we need to do here. Okay. 
and we can make this thing now. Okay, so there's our compressor. Okay, I need to think about how we're going to handle this power-wise because I have all these machines over here. I mean, we do have power. I mean, this is an LV deal right here. I mean, we could essentially just go over here if we wanted to. I mean, do we just want to do this just for testing purposes? I mean, I guess we could, right? I mean, I've got... Yeah, I've got 32 EU power coming there. Where did I get this moss stone from? I don't, I don't know where that came from. <laughs> okay. All right. So we need a cable. Man, why are we running back and forth? We got to get a wireless crafter. We'll have to work on that next episode. Man, we are deep in the rabbit hole. That's for sure. Okay. Okay, cable. Okay, we just need one of these. Okay, compressor. Okay, I would assume that this thing is super slow. But I, I don't know if I'm too worried about it. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I am. Okay, so we can put that there. And that right there. Okay. Alright, and then we can put these guys in there. Oh, do we have to smelt it first? Yeah, we do. Okay, you come out of there. All right, let's put this in on our furnace. Okay, smelted. Okay, now if I put this back in here, will this run now? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's super slow. All right, and I don't really see a way to upgrade this. That's okay. We just need two of these, though. How else can we make them? Rolling machine. From advanced rocketry, we'll make them. Oh, we didn't need to make that thing. Okay, here, let's take these out of here. Okay, now I understand. So we were not putting the right thing in there. So we can just do that right there. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we didn't even need to make that machine, but we did. Oh, there's some cool stuff in there. Let's get that out of there. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's go up here. So we wasted some of our iron. Well, that's okay. We learned. We learned. That's good. That's good. Nothing wrong with that. Okay. So grinder is what we're trying to make here, right? Industrial grinder. So we need one of these. We can make it like this. Then oh, we used our. Oh, dang it. Let's get some steel. And let me go throw this in this thing okay i tell you what let me jump off camera and let us let's do this first of all let me jump off camera and let me get some of this stuff made and i'll come back and we'll see if we can't make this industrial grinder it looks like i'm gonna have to be making some of these machine casings as well and i don't know if i need so there's like a machine casing from machine casing standard machine casing reinforced machine casing Okay, so standard is, oh my goodness gracious, we're going to need tons of rubber. Okay, all right, well, let me get some of this stuff made. I'll be back with you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends, we are back. So I made myself a bunch of refined iron ingots. So we have a bunch of those now, which is kind of cool. You know, I was looking at this, I was reading the guide here, trying to understand. And it says, your first goal should be the industrial grinder, so you get additional items from grinding ores. Okay. So I'm trying to figure out what I would need that for. So like if I look at ores, and there's like some fancy different kinds of ores that are out there. Like let's just look at diamond ore. No. Let's look at diamond ore, and then we'll see what the use is for that. And do we have industrial grinder? So this, so if I grind one of these, we get this stuff. Okay. Is there like a way to look at the recipes? Can I look at here? Okay. So, netherrack, I get a little bit of gold and some netherrack dust. Okay. Copper, I get some stuff. Copper, gold. Okay. So, essentially, it works very similar to... I don't know. What's that? The Like, the ore washing plant? Maybe not. The Like, the centrifuge? Okay. 
But is there anything that I specifically need from like maybe some more of these advanced ores? Gold dust, gold dust, okay. Emeralds. I mean, it looks like we get a little bit more than one. Sulfur, silver. Red garnet, ruby dust, ruby. Platinum and iridium ingot if I put iridium ore, which I don't have, so. Okay. So I definitely can get bauxite dust. Cinnabar. So I don't know. I don't know if I actually need an industrial grinder after. Man, I'm a little bit confused. Okay. So then you should work towards the industrial blast furnace, which needs all of this stuff. Now you can make titanium from bauxite and chrome from rubies. And advance into the next age. You also need the electrolyzer. Okay. Oh my goodness. I might have to do a little bit of electrolyzer. Is that this thing? No. Uh, no. This. Extractor. Destroy extra. I mean, we were working towards making one of those. Is there a use for this thing? Oh my. What is this crazy stuff right here? <laughs> okay, I need to do some research. Oh my goodness. Well, I think we're going to end the episode there. I need to figure out some stuff. You know, we actually did pretty good work today. We made some Tech Reborn machines, which is kind of cool. We got ourselves into age 10, which is the technological age. Um, we checked out our Blaze Farm and made sure it was working the way it wants to. Man, we got to figure out what's going on for sure because I feel like we are at the precipice of maybe the deepest deep rabbit hole that we've ever seen. So we got to figure that out. But until then, please remember to be cool. Don't be a fool. And from the Age of Engineering where, I'll admit it, I'm a little confused about exactly what we need to do. Oh, good grief. <laughs> I guess we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.